Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Thank you to everyone who watched my first ever video. The link is in the description down below so go check it out. And thank you to everyone who subscribed to my channel. And I'm so excited for my new channel. So guys, it's my 30th birthday this week, so I'm going to be making the ultimate surprise piñata cake. But before we get started, make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos. Make sure you stay till the end to see what Brooke and Rosie have in store for me this week. Hopefully it's something good because it's my birthday. Time to get ready for baking guys. But first, you need to tie your hair back, wash your hands and put an apron on if you don't want to get your clothes dirty. So let's talk ingredients. You need butter, three eggs, baking powder, vanilla extract, self-raising flour, caster sugar and chocolate. So guys, I have forgot a few ingredients so I'm going to have to go to my local shop and get some chocolate fingers and some cocoa powder. But we have to take Brooke and Rosie with me. So anything can happen. Let's go. Okay, so we are outside of the cult right now and we are about to go inside. Lewis is going to go one way and me and Brooke are going to go the other. So let's go. But I'm thinking, so Lil's has actually said to me that it's got to be something good. But I'm thinking that we should put something really, really bad inside of it. So I found the chocolate fingers and I'm going to get two packs. So me and Brooke are now in the chocolate aisle. We're right here. And we're trying to decide yeah. which chocolate we should get to put in there. Well, it might not even be chocolate. There's sweets here yeah. as well. So there's like fruitellas, squashies. Thinking, I'm thinking Reese's. I don't but know does why. Lil's like Reese's? I, That's no. Lil doesn't like it. But so, yeah. Lil doesn't like mint either. And we found the peppermint arrows. I think we should put both of these in. We should put both of these in. Yeah. Since Lil's hates peanut butter. These have got peanut butter in. But me and Brooke absolutely love them. And then I like these. Do you like these? No. No. But we can put them in anyway. So we have now got the two packets of Reese's and the two packets of Airbnb. Um, yeah. And we're trying to avoid Lily and she's saying that we, she actually saw these and we said, okay, we'll do something different, but we're not going to. We're trying to no. trick her, aren't we? So I think we've decided yeah. we're going to get these. So should we go pay? Yeah, let's go. So I found the cocoa and I'm going to get that because I'm going to put it in the buttercream to make chocolate buttercream. I'm back from the car and I've got all the ingredients that I need. Luckily, they have them all. So let's get baking. But first, I've made three tiers already for this cake and I'm going to do the last tier with you. And you just have to follow this recipe four times to make this cake. Time to get the oven on, guys. And you need to put it to 180 degrees Celsius. So what we need to do is measure out all the ingredients. So first measure out the butter and I've got 175 grams which is also 6 ounces. So you need to put that in first and then you need to measure out 175 grams which is also 6 ounces of caster sugar and put that in. And then you need to cream all of that together until it's a bit of a lighter colour. Let's put that all in. Okay. Time to cream. So now that is all done. We can move on to the eggs. So you need three eggs. You need to crack them into a bowl first. 
because if you get any shell in it, it doesn't matter. But then you also need to beat, beat the eggs as well. Okay. beating all three eggs together because my nan told me from my last video you have to beat them before they go in the mixture. That's all beated. Let's put them in. So you need to give that a quick mix first before you add in the rest of your ingredients. Now I need to add in the vanilla extract and the baking powder. So I've got one teaspoon of vanilla extract. I'm gonna put that in. And then I also need one teaspoon of baking powder. Let's get that. And try and make it as level as you can, so then it's exactly right. Okay. I'm going to give that a quick mix but only with a spatula this time. Get your sieve ready guys. So now I need to put in the flour and I've got 175 grams which is also 6 ounces of self raising flour. So you need to sieve that in. Try and do a little bit at a time because then it is better and easier for you to mix into the like, mixture. So you need to fold this in. Now for the rest of the flour. Sieve that and then I need to fold all the rest of it in. Now that's done. So I'm folding it very carefully which prevents lots of air bubbles which you don't want in your cake. So this is the perfect consistency now guys and the perfect amount for one of these tiers. And if you want to make four of these then you need to times this by four. So now I need to grease and get my pan ready to put the butter in. So I just use the seal from the butter, I put some of the butter on it and then put it around the edges. And then I've also put some parchment paper down in the bottom, which fits perfectly in the bottom. Now it's the exciting part guys, to pour the butter into the pan. We pour all of it in and it should rise right just about to the top. So guys, I'm about to put the fourth tier of the cake in. Make sure you get help with that step. So now I'm going to cut the middle out of two of the layers because Rosie and Brooke are gonna come in in a minute and put something which I don't know what it is inside this cake and you have to stay tuned to the end to watch me, like my reaction of what it is. Let's do it. Time to cut the centre guys. roughly as best as you can in the middle and put it down. Done. Ooh, this is very nice. I think I might have this later. This is what it looks like and now I'm going to do the next one. Try and get it roughly in the centre and push down. Wiggle it around. And 
this out and it's another one for me to eat later. Guys, it was just by guess and it looks mm -hmm. perfect. I got it in the middle and they're exactly the same. Am I meant to be putting this in? No, I don't think so. But it's in the last video though. No, Mum, it's too late now. Really? <laughs> The video is nearly done, it's a bit late Mum. Because I want this to be a two tier cake, I'm going to make a slight step in the top two layers. So I'm going to measure a circle, I think here, and then I'm going to cut this. So because this is a very sharp knife, I'm going to get my mum to do this off camera. But I'm going to try and do a little bit now. So I'm trimming round the edge of the cake so we can have a step on the cake. So the cake is out of the oven now and it's cooling off and my mum has cut it to the same size as this layer and now I have to leave this cake, my pride and joy, in the hands of Brooke and Rosie. I really hope this goes well. And they have to fill this hole with like, a secret ingredient. I really hope it's good. I don't want to leave it, they're going to ruin it. I don't want to leave you. Oh, I hope they don't hurt you. <laughs> right, so we are putting the secret ingredients into Lily's fabulous cake. So Brooke, what have we got? So we've got peanut butter Reese's. Chocolate mint arrow. Lil's doesn't even like it though. She likes M&M, um, uh, Reese's though. I don't even think she likes peanut butter, but anyway, she likes M&M's. So we have got two packets of M&M's. One packet's on here right now, and the other packet is in here. So let's we need to get rid of them because yeah. Lil's is gonna come in and she's gonna see. So I'm gonna so. put all the, these are like all mixed up and chopped up. So. so I put some of them in and then some of these so that we can have like layers. Yeah. Oh no! Oh my gosh! Oh she's, my gosh. Gonna, she's gonna, she's gonna notice. It's gonna oh my gosh! She's, okay. gonna, she's gonna notice. She's, she's really gonna notice. Put it all in, oh my and gosh. then I'll put some of these in next. Okay, put some of them in, and then we're just gonna have to pour the whole entire thing in, otherwise she's gonna see the whole packet. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> I think, I, sh I think we should just eat them. Right, quick. Oh, we've got enough there. <laughs> Definitely. We just need mm, to get all of them. That's so good. Is there any left? Oh, hang on. What do we need to do now? We need to cover it. The top. <gasps> yeah, ready? We can't break this. Ready? Right. It on slowly, make sure it's all pressed down, so she can't see it. Right, it looks good. Yeah, all the way around. Yep. Looks really good. Right, mission accomplished. Okay. Just chilling out while they're ruining my cake. Just checking my subscribers. And while I'm on it, don't forget to subscribe. So I'm back and they haven't ruined it, but I'm a bit nervous of what's inside. Anyway, let's put the buttercream on the cake and I'm going to put it everywhere this time. So I'm just going to get this. I'm going to spread it everywhere. So you want to try and get quite a thick layer because like you want enough to cover everything so you don't see anything. So 
the cake is perfectly iced. And now my mum is going to shave some chocolate with a potato peeler to put on the top of the cake. Now for my favourite part, the decorating. So I'm going to put all the chocolate fingers around here and here. Just got a bit on my finger. Anyway, let's put them on. These have to go on here and on here, around the whole thing. And if you're wondering what this is, that is for the piping, but you'll be able to see more of that in a minute. So you can see I liked it. All the chocolate fingers are on, so now it's time for a bit of piping. Now it's time to put the chocolate curls on, which my mum prepared earlier. Sprinkle them on the top. Oh, this cake is gonna be so chocolatey. So guys, my cake is done and I'm really happy with it. I'm so excited to see what the girls have put inside. So you can see me cut this cake on my birthday right about now. Oh my god! That Lily discovers what Brooke and Rosie put in her cake. Is she gonna like it? Yes or no? Bills, how are you feeling? Not good. I'll have that. Thanks. Thanks. Oh, that is So if you like this video guys, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to her channel and click the notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos. Bye! That's it on the floor. <laughs> Have the cake then. Being creative with the leftovers. Mwah. <laughs>